So we're going to see how this looks. Oh. Got this one the other day, the Arctic. You've all seen it. Hopefully, you watched the video on it. There is an unboxing and a review. There's the back of the keyboard. Very, very cool. And uh, the one thing it's going to need. I want this to last for quite a while. Now, uh, I only had one question on it. Did I send the support? They haven't got back to me yet. Just a simple one. The owner's manual states that the charging light will turn off. All I got was the charging light being red and then it went to green. So this might be a newer version. And everything else in the owner's manual was correct. Uh, the thing works flawlessly. I highly recommend, though, if you buy one of these. And if you do, use my affiliate link in the description below. Uh, hit the control key to wake it up. Or the cat lock key. Which is the reason I bought it. And I always leave the back lights on. I know. Well, it's going to use your bed. Yeah, I don't care. You don't really expect to get six months battery use out of it. If I can get for a week, plug it in for a couple hours at night while I sleep. I don't care. It's only 500 million batteries. So I'm guessing once it goes green, it's fully charged. But I don't know that. If somebody has one of these, let me know. Uh, if you have an older version, maybe your light does turn out. Now you can charge this on a 2 amp charger. That's up to you. Go for it. If you're brave. I mean, I don't want to fry it. Uh, I'd rather just plug it into a 1 amp. Running off the uh, desktop here. And it should still charge. Four and a half, five hours should have been enough. It wasn't blinking or low charge when I got it. I just didn't know the power light went out right away. Just told you, hey, power's on. It works flawlessly so far. I'm just letting you know that. And, uh, that's all I have for tonight. Basically a quick follow-up. And uh, no, no full reviews or anything like that. Um, but make sure to read the description below. And if you found this useful, helpful, any of those things, please click the little subscribe button and uh, the notification bell. And kind of all along. Uh, one thing this thing is going to need is going to be a little keyboard vacuum. That's a must. Um, one of two things are going to happen. Either I have to quit smoking, which is unlikely to happen, although it depends on what the doctor says tomorrow. Um, or I gotta quit spilling crumbs and all kinds of other crud into my keyboards. Put a little keyboard vacuum. If anyone has a suggestion, I looked around at Amazon and I didn't see anything that just kind of jumped out at me like, that's perfect. It's a small keyboard, it's got a brush style, you know, brush and sweep and suck it all up and keep that keyboard clean because there's not a whole lot of key travel here to play with and we don't want nothing down in there uh, other than that all I got if you do make these uh, vacuum deals and you're trying to get into the US market on Amazon you need somebody to test it click our above page Click the email, send us an email. 
no, we're not going to buy it and review it, and then you'll reimburse us. It does not work that way. You'll pay us, we'll buy it, and then we'll review it. Because you're going to get an honest review, and you're not going to pay if you get a bad review. It's as simple as that. Can't trust anyone. Or if you just want to send one out, if you're not just the marketing guy, send this one out. Be happy to review it. Be fantastic. Have a great night, folks.